What's good YouTube? It's your boy Back to Ball and Wood. I'm coming to you guys today with another lit reaction video, bro. So in this reaction video today, man, we about to react to that man, Mr. Zialas, man. What not to do when you are an overnight success. Bro, I've seen this so many times, chat. Someone gained a lot of money when they used to have nothing. And they blew all of that money by doing stupid things. Or even when you make like, say for example, make it on YouTube. You get up there and you just don't know what to do. And like it's a you fall hard more like than you came up you're falling like harder than you like came up bro and that's the crazy part but you can also like regain that like success back but it just takes patience and you just you just got to like have a lot of discipline if you become a, a celebrity overnight or if you just have success overnight bro so hopefully he's teaching us a lesson of what and what not to do I need y'all to like comment and sub please also, let's get to it. After becoming famous overnight, yeah, that's the question. I wrote some stuff out. I'm gonna try to make this as quick as possible. Also, it's really echoing in here. <sighs> I did not think that was gonna be that loud. I'm gonna level with you guys real quick. As you might be aware, about a month ago, I had pretty much the craziest thing that's ever happened to me happen to me through the Mr. Beast crew, which I'm super grateful for. Oh my gosh, guys. I feel like I've done a couple things a little bit out of whack, so bear yeah. with me as I explain this. It'll make sense. Say there's this person, and you like this person, and you want to have, and you end up being able to go out on a date with them. And from there, you proceed to put on a total facade of who you actually are in order to impress them, and then like six months down the line, your real yeah. personality comes out, and- That's a fact, bro, because sometimes, like, you're on here and like say for example i don't curse in none of my videos and i'm like portraying this image and then eventually i'm just cursing in my videos just being mean to all of my supporters not reacting to nothing you guys tell me to react to but what i want to react to and just just being very disrespectful i love y'all like y'all family personally bro so i get what he's talking about like you just actually showing your true colors once you make it or another side the, like the money like gets to your head or something bro i know exactly what you're saying uh the illness and things don't really work out because she liked this other person that you made up yeah right that's what i want to avoid doing with you guys when it's not just one person but rather like two million people who are now like looking at me and i want to get to know them and maybe like six of you guys want to get to know me like when i really think about it i need to be me right off the bat so what up i'm matthew aka Zealous. Zealous. So for instance, the ramen video. That one, that it was miserable. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to y'all, we faked the trick shots. That just didn't feel right at all. Oh. Please, Lord God. Chet, honestly, I was like, yo, is he really that legit when it comes to them trick shots? I was like, man, that's tough. Oh, crap. Frick. Frick. Big miss. Oh, frick. Cut. That sucks. Oh, no. I'm sorry. We filmed a couple different videos like the ramen video where things ended up not going right. Who's up there? Matthew and Kendall. No, who's up there? What, are you, what is that? Who is that? That's a random guy. And I just haven't uploaded it. And then there's been other videos where like my brother got his eyebrows shaved because he lost the challenge. Oh, the moment. I'm about to cry. <laughs> it just went way too far and it was my fault. And um, yeah, y'all yeah. like, I just don't want to become a sociopath. Yeah. Slipping further and further away as the seconds go on. <laughs> that was not going up either. Sorry, boys. <laughs> I think the most eye-opening thing has been like how much I'm trying to number one, people please, even though like no one's asking me to make any specific content. It's literally like Facts. all my doing. And at the same time, how perfectionistic I've been. This opportunity has like times the perfectionism problem that I deal with by like 40. And I'm just trying to figure out how to like at least meet in the middle. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Not gonna lie y'all, I am being a little bit more energetic. I had to go hype myself up in the mirror a little bit. <laughs> so what? <laughs> all the careers who I really respect and also have had the opportunity to like meet, they've all been pretty much the exact same on camera as they are in person. So I guess the question comes down to like, what do I enjoy making and what made me want to start YouTube in the first place? I just really enjoy making videos. I've been making videos since I was like seven years old. I didn't script this. No, I don't. And then it went to like action skits inspired by like Freddie Wong. Is this thing about to go off? It just like beeped or something. I don't know why I'm wearing it. Kind of adds to my girlish figure. <laughs> From there it progressed yeah. into like, wow, not only do I like making stuff, but I like connecting with people too at the same time. Honestly, bro, what I think that you have to do is just be yourself. That's what I'm doing right now, bro. I'm honestly, I'm being myself, chat. But I'm going crazy as I'm being myself because I'm not taking no for an answer. I'm not taking no for an answer. Straight like that. I'm telling y'all, man, I can't lie to y'all, bro. 
YouTube is like the perfect place because it's not TV. You're not like isolated from your audience. You get to interact with your audience and you get to create whatever you want. And I just don't want to, I don't want to get lost in the sauce. I don't want to lose why I started doing YouTube in the first place. I think the main thing that got me off track was the fact that I felt like I needed to immediately level up my content like 40 times what it's been in the past. It literally feels like I'm trying to like grow into oversized clothes. It's not going to happen that quickly. I need to be patient and I need to be okay for like at least a couple months building it up and using like the new resources and connections and stuff that this has brought to yeah. build up to that new content. And I'm thankful for whoever bears with me while I, while I do that and really try to earn this, but I'm not going to earn it as a different person than who I am. At the end of the day, I just want to get to know you guys as the person that God made me to be. I will keep trying. I will keep failing. I will yeah. keep learning and I'll keep improving the content, but I'm here to tell you that it's going to be a little bit more of a process than just it's automatic like snap everything is freaking insane so with all that out of the way um here's a compilation i chose three or four specific videos because i really enjoyed making them hopefully i can do videos similar to this except on a bigger and bigger scale in the future i know that you can do a better video and a bigger video than that bro and honestly it's gonna take time bro like because they didn't build a whole room in one day me personally bro i told myself i'm gonna start youtube last year around this time I did start YouTube last year around this time and I gave up because I was just like, it's not me. And now I found myself, I'm happy. I'm just as happy as I can be. Let's just say that. And I'm loving it, bro. It's the best. <laughs> Yo, oh, shoot. We're jumping over clay. <laughs> Seventh result when you type in Matthew D. I made it. So we just passed 5,000 subscribers. I will be giving 1 million subscribers to one of these four YouTubers. That's about all I have to say for this update video. Yo, that ain't lit, bro. Yo, he gonna be something serious, bro. I'm telling y'all, bro. Y'all gonna be like, yo, react to this, react to this. I'm telling y'all, man. Please, y'all. That's the end of the vid. Please like, comment, and sub. Not to mention, stay juiced up. Yeah, we out, man. I can't get no rest. We in the house. I fall asleep with a tech. Fashion on the pills. I'm